Hello everyone, and here is our weather update on February 29th, 2024. Happy leaping day everyone, um, and let's get on with it. So today we saw sunshine and heavy showers over the country, um, some heavy end of hail, and some wintry over high ground. Tonight we will see rain moving in from the west overnight, turning more wintry as it heads further eastwards and northwards. Check out our snow watch for more than that. Um, as our leaping day special. So snow risk highest in South Ulster and North Leinster on this UKV run, but it does spread southwards tomorrow morning. The whole area of rain, sleet and snow does clear away tomorrow afternoon, um, though it it will be quite a slow process in parts of the southeast. Um, tomorrow night we will see showers packing into the north, some wintry, and Saturday is basically a day of sunshine, but a lot of convection with um, showers forming, some, some quite heavy with hail and sleet with snow over higher ground. Heaviest and most frequent in the east, while I think that in the western southwest there'll be some decent dry spells and also some nice sunshine. Into Sunday, we see some more showers forming. I think on Sunday, there'll be mainly of rain and hail with the odd sleet shower over higher ground as Sunday will be a bit less cold than previous days. It's in Monday then, next area of rain comes in f from, from southwest um, f and further rain showers into Tuesday. Looking at our temperature forecast from the UKV, you can see it today it was quite a chilly day with highs of four to seven degrees. Tonight the lowest temperatures where it's not raining, we'll see lows of about freezing to plus, th to plus three degrees mildest under the rain um, but as I said before, this will turn to snow and sleet in some areas, especially over high grounds. Um, where tomorrow it's raining and raining or snowing, highest temperatures of around two to four, around of around two to four degrees. Elsewhere, highs of five to seven. Tomorrow night we'll see lowest temperatures dropping down to around um, one to three degrees. Saturdays are highs of of a cold. Um, four to six Celsius. Saturday nights we'll see possible frost in the southeast. And for on Sunday we see some less cold temperatures of six to eight. Um, possibly frost in Ulster on um Sunday nights. To Monday highest temperatures of five Celsius. Under rain elsewhere from six to eight Celsius. And into tomorrow night Tuesday, again frosty for a time in the north before we see milder rain moving in from the south. So here is the NAO next observed and forecasted. So we are currently with the NAO um, dropping back towards a more, um, let's see, a more neutral level. I will stay that way into early March and drop into actually quite a negative level. And some runs are again today pulling off an easterly winds. So tonight, th that's that low that's bringing in this wintry mix tonight, especially for the north and east Midlands. Tomorrow and into Saturday, we go into a northerly wind and sunshine and showers, some heavy and wintry. On Sunday, some more showers form. Into Monday, we see this next low coming in with um, some further rain and strong winds at times as well. Um, beyond that, we see heights driving towards Scandinavia before that battles with lows to the west. What comes off this? We actually get easterly winds. Um, into the early part of the second week of March. It stays easterly or possibly even southeasterly beyond that. Um, and in the end, a high pressure builds from the Azores to Scandinavia, so it was drier and more spring like into mid March actually on this run. Looking at our ECM 12, there's an ECM. Oh god, what did I just do? Uh, it's a glitch though, I don't know what happens. Refresh that page. Um, okay, that, that's a glitch for Friday. I don't know what's wrong with that, that's a glitch. Either way, Saturday, Saturday, low pressure to our east, bringing in these cold northerly winds with showers. Sunday, we see more showers, but I think they'll be less heavy than Saturdays. Monday, low to our south, bringing rain to the south, but dry to the north. And then high pressure builds towards Scandinavia next week. And we end up really pulling in an easterly winds by the end of next week so by by Sunday March 10th we're pulling in a um, cold easterly 
So that's something new from the ECM. Looking at the GEM, you can see at GEM, th th this low comes through tonight and tomorrow, bring, bringing a wintry mix before into Saturday and Sunday. We go to showers and cold weather. Monday, next low comes in from the west and southwest. Stays wet and windy into next week. Um, heights most of the east, so in this scenario, winds come up from the south. Now eventually, by the end of the run, we do get a more easterly tilt to the winds, upper temperatures start to lower from the east by then. That's that one done. Looking at the UK map run now. UK map run. Going for that low tonight and tomorrow morning. Stinking through. And Saturday is showering cold. Sunday is a bit less cold but, but showery as well. Uh, Monday this, this following low comes in. Bringing rain from the south. And next week we just see hot rising towards Scandinavia. Low to the west. And by Thursday March 7th Quite a mild wind from the southeast, but it, but it wouldn't take much to pull in this easterly winds. After our temperatures by then, we have cold air just to our east, a puddle of cold air over Europe. But for, but for all time, that is a mild pattern next week. Um, but guys, a southerly can easily turn to an easterly. Here is the icon. The icon is is sinking that low through into tonight and tomorrow then we go into con shower weekend followed by a lower monday and heights rising to our northeast let's see what happens here we i think that's a drier pattern a bit chilly by night but quite a nice pattern as well a bit of spring like by day and finally the arpege arpege again tonight could be wintry before we go into a con shower weekend Followed on um, Monday and Tuesday by next low, and is starting to pull in a more of an easterly influence by Tuesday, with high pressure rising, rising towards Scandinavia. So, everyone, thanks for watching. Happy Leaping Day, and I'll see you tomorrow for the 1st of March.